Hi guys, I'll show you how to echo print using a hammer. First, I'm gathering these leaves and flowers as the main material for this project. This is actually my first try. I'm just curious how this art project will turn out. Here's my white handkerchief. First try zinnia. Put clear plastic on the top of the flower. Now let's start pounding. Don't mind the rusty hammer. I don't have a choice. Oh no, it's brown. I didn't expect this. Let's try arranging it. It hardly changes anything. Let's try the aster flower. It's the same. Try these leaves. Please don't embarrass me. Pound it hard to make sure the juice comes out. Yes, I made it. Another one. I don't know what this is called. It just grows wild in my backyard. It's not bad. I'm giving this aster a chance. Same result. More leaves, because I'm sure it'll be pretty. This is a silver cox comb flower, and it has red leaves. I added some wild clover leaves too. Wow, these turn out amazing. Mayana leaves and silver cocks comb in between. I like it crowded and cluttered. I like this Mayana too. The details are on point. I'm making a design, hoping to cover the zinnia flower print. I know this is chaotic, but trust the process. This is a rose leaf. I'm pounding it really hard to get the juice from it, but the leaves are just so dry. This is a globanran flower. It has so much juice in it, but it rarely gives you color. My favorite of them all. Look at the details, it has green in the middle. The result. I love it. If you like this video, please hit the follow or subscribe button. Thank you.